barbecue food for you. Today we're cooking up a couple delicious burgers that everyone should love using a new technique that I've never seen done before with the grilling stones from BrazilianIce.com. This is for Man Cave Meals Summer Burger Blast Video Contest. We're going to be using our Weber 22 and a half inch kettle fired up with Kebbroke hardwood lump charcoal. We got a chimney lid on the side burner. Get that on, we'll go get the burgers prepped. First thing we're going to do is go in, wash some of these vegetables, get everything all cut up and prepped for the burgers. Veggies are all prepped and ready and we're going to put them back in the fridge. For the bun, we're just using a bakery style Kaiser. Going to brush on some garlic, salt and pepper here. Buns have a nice coating of that butter mixture on there. Let's get started on the burgers. To make the burgers, we're going to be using 80-20 ground chuck. Now this is one pound, so we're just going to split it in half and lightly form it into a round pad. The burgers lightly formed, take a piece of parchment paper, throw it on a plate, wrap it up, and stick it in the fridge. First thing we're gonna do is grill up some of our homemade bacon we made a few weeks ago. Bacon's looking great, time to get it off the grill. We're going to toast the buns on the grilling stone, so just give them a quick scrape, clean them off. Now time to toast our buns. Just throw them on the grilling stone for about a minute or two and they'll be all ready to go. Just before we get the burgers on, we're going to get the buns prepped because they are not going to take long to cook. So we'll start with a little bit of mayo on the bottom bun, toss on some iceberg lettuce, a few pickles, and a slice of processed cheese. And for the top of the bun, a little bit of ketchup and mustard. We'll get the onions and tomatoes on after we get the burger on. To season the burger, we're gonna be using smoked sea salt and fresh cracked peppercorns. Let's go get them on the grill. Now the good part. Start by sprinkling on some salt and pepper directly on the grilling stones. A nice even coating. Take your burgers, toss them right on. Sprinkle some more salt and pepper directly on top of the meat. And now the moment of truth. We're going to take this second grilling stone, flip it right on top. Let that cook for a couple minutes. These burgers will come out perfect. Listen to those burgers sizzling away between those two grilling stones. Smells great. Burgers have been cooking for around three and a half minutes. Let's pull the stone off and take a peek. Oh, we lost one little piece, but looking pretty good. Let's take them off, get them on the buns. With the burgers just off the grill, throw on another piece of cheese. Top them with some of our homemade bacon. Looking good. A couple tomatoes. And a little bit of onion. Time to dig in. Check it out. Mm. Nice, hot, juicy, cheesy, dripping juice. Mm. It's a good burger. This is going to be an interesting contest. Kept this one nice and simple, easy and delicious, because these are the burgers that I love to eat. It's easy to do. Barbecue food for you. Give it a try. Mm-hmm.